up guys so by the project and here for another video um just gonna get my big thoughts on tlc uh which was this past sunday um i really thought it was a good pay-per-view um there was some not okay matches but um anyway the pay-per-view was good overall uh it was enjoyable so if you guys haven't checked it out you guys should uh already um I know I'm pretty much late with this, but I'm just going to go with a TLC review, uh, well, briefly. Um, just quick thoughts, um, as well as for my, uh, predictions. I didn't really do so well on them, but, um, anyway, let's get on with, uh, the results. Of course, Christian ended up retaining. I uh, really thought Shelton Benjamin was going to win. Uh, that did not happen. Um, for the Intercontinental Championship match. Uh, Drew McIntyre, uh, defeated John Morrison, which, um, I really thought Morrison was going to retain. And, um, I gotta tell you, John Morrison isn't doing too well in, um, pay-per-view-wise. Um, maybe he'll get into the world title picture or something like that soon. Uh, next match, we'll go to Mickey James versus Michelle McCool. Mickey James lost to Michelle McCool, um, which was a pretty enjoyable theaters match. Uh, it, it wasn't that good, but, you know, it was, like, in between, so it was pretty good. Uh, even though Mickey James didn't win, hopefully, hopefully, she will, um, get that title soon. Um, what else? We got the WWE Championship match, uh, John Cena versus Sheamus in the tables match. Uh, that was a pretty good match. Sheamus ended up defeating... Uh, John Cena becoming the new WWE Champion. Of course, that is a big shocker now. Um, of course, we have a new, um, you know, young upcoming star as the WWE Champion. I'm not, uh, too mad about it, but, um, I think I'm willing to give Sheamus a chance to see how he's going to do. Um, I think he's going to lose the title maybe at the Royal Rumble and not have, like, such a long title ring. Um, I'm not saying I don't hate Seamus, um, but I'm willing to give him a chance. Uh, next match, we go into the World Tournament Championship match. Uh, Batista did win briefly, but the match was, uh, restarted, and then Adam Tika came back and did, uh, win that match. Um, even though my prediction was Batista to win, he did kind of win, but... Uh, really, Undertaker, I uh, retain his title. Uh, then we go into Kofi versus Randy Orton. Of course, Randy Orton winning this match, which wasn't too bad of a match. It was kind of slow paced, but it was still, uh, pretty enjoyable to watch. And, um, I'm not too mad about Randy Orton winning, so it's okay with me. Uh, then we go into the tag team TLC, uh, match, uh, with the Unified Tag Team Championship. And, um, DX did win. This is my prediction that uh, actually came right with this, and I think it was pretty obvious. And um, Jericho is no longer the Unified Tag Team Champion. Uh, maybe uh, Chris Jericho will now go into the world title picture now, uh, since he's not uh, a Unified Tag Team Champion. Maybe as well as for the Big Show. I don't know what else. Uh, he's going to do right now, but DX are the new tag team champions. Overall, like I said, this is a pretty good pay-per-view. Uh, I'm happy about it. Uh, let me know what you guys think about that. If you guys aren't subscribed, I think you should, uh, should subscribe to the page, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.